Hello and welcome back for episode two in Hard Space Ship Breaker. We are now a Lynx asset and uh, we're, we're getting started on day two. Uh, day one was interesting. We started breaking down our first ship and uh, no deaths yet. We've only got 30 of those to deal with, so we're going to get started on shift number two. Here we go. Hello, ship breaker. Please enjoy this inspirational message. The last 10% of a job takes as much energy as the first 90%, which is why it's so important to always give 110%. Hab voice, it's just got so much valuable information for you every time you wake up, but you gotta love it. So here are our daily fees. Oh, our fees are only uh, half a million dollars every day. Only half a million, so that's good to know. So we're, our goal is to make more than half a million every day. So we're not uh, going the wrong direction with our money. We did get some tokens. I wonder if I can upgrade anything yet. Kind of a cool view of our suit. Posters. I think we can change those. But we're going to see. Oh, got one sticker. We better... Uh, put the sticker on this machine so uh, we can see it and put it here on our grapple use our, our grapple quite often let's yep, yep stick that one right there it'll be perfect and this is where we can upgrade our tools and repair them uh, so this is where your repair kits come in so these things do wear down over time as you can see that last last shift Took nearly 7% off of our grapple and our thrusters. So, gotta, gotta watch those things. If I can, I'd like to get some extra range on my cutter. Because right now it's just kind of short. It makes me get real close. So, split saw. You know, I have to get to level 5 before we can start upgrading things. That's disappointing. Same for the grapple? Yep, same for the grapple. All right, well, don't worry about that yet. Let's get to our shift. We're going to continue cutting up this ship that uh, we've been working on. I think we can get get a lot of it turned in here real quick, so let's, let's get to it. We're going to continue salvaging. Hop to it. You can see our fuel going down, so our fuel does not refill when we go back to the hab. Our oxygen does, our oxygen reloads. But I think, I think there was fuel in this next area just beyond the door. And so once we start getting a little low on fuel, we'll grab that bottle and top it up. canister right there. We've also got another oxygen. Uh, ooh, repair kits. Let's go ahead and grab that. We can collect you and you. You go to the barge. Barge. Salvage secured. Account credit applied. second. Is there anything back there? there? Ain't nothing back there. So that's processor, processor. We're just gonna cut that whole thing loose. I think that's a good idea. I'm actually gonna check in there around the fuel containers that are on each side before I actually do that because I think it's a great idea right now but it might not. Salvage Getting secured. this to the Credit processor deposited. is a good idea. Oh. Valuable 
object processed. Engines on this Credits one. Deposited. That needs to go to the barge. That needs to go to the processor. Let's get this cut. Ah, so annoying. So you need to go down. This game's a lot of uh, flying around. Getting in the right position. Salvage deposit registered. And that Account engine credited. was valuable. Let's just try to pull that off there. That is heavy. That's all we had to do. Processor all right, sweet. Accepted. Let's get you on Credits down awarded. there. That pipe is going processor. That's going processor. We'll leave that connected. Let's cut this other engine off. pressure to worry about, so Salvage we're going to go ahead and cut transferring credit. the uh, thruster cap loose. Just got to hit those cut points. Those are, those are the key. There's always those uh, points for most things. Most things have that little signifier that gets the modular pieces apart. So this is the airlock that we ruin. It just goes to furnace. It's pretty light. Warning. Oxygen low. We're going to reload our oxygen fuel here in just a second. Let's go ahead and start working our way towards that. Salvage deposited. Applying credit to account. Saves us sixteen thousand dollars. Can't believe it costs that much for a tank of oxygen. But... Uh, 
The doors. The doors can go. I've never really tried cutting out the doors yet. Instead of leaving the angles for the door. There we go. That piece is loose. There's another. Let's figure out which way is up, right? Furnace. I can actually, I believe, use. Yeah. Orange, orange, everything's orange. Except for that. Might as well use that patch kit just in case. Alright, now we move it. Alright, we can't, we can't move it. It's too heavy. We're gonna have to break this down a little bit more. Obviously, some of the ship we haven't got turned in. Which it looks like we got both engines. But the ticker up top is showing us that there's something left over. So we're gonna end, we're gonna end. Links recommends avoiding stressful work. New certification 
level awarded. License upgraded. So we got one repair kit. I don't think I'm going back out there for this one because I don't I didn't see anything left over. We didn't destroy anything. Just racking my brain trying to think of what we may have missed. But I don't know. We're gonna we're gonna end that shift. Good morning, Cutter. It's time to begin your work day. Ooh. Got hazard level three clearance. We are now qualified to handle electrical hazards during salvage. Due to regulatory rollbacks introduced in 2299, Link's salvage does not do a preliminary exam of ships to disconnect potential electrical hazards. We believe our shipbreakers are well suited to handle such dangers and the long term time savings are highly beneficial. Electrical components may arc when removed, impacted, or damaged, causing other objects to be electrified, including the shipbreaker themselves. This can cause damage to the Link's spare and Link's equipment. Caution is advised. Comes with a new ship, the Mackerel Exolab. Typically used for deep space research, the Mackerel Exolab is outfitted with a wide variety of scientific instrumentation. Extract the fragile equipment carefully and beware of electrical hazards. Got a quote here. It's my predecessor Ted incorrectly stated that there were frequent electrocutions aboard Exolabs. Actually, those electrocutions are still being investigated. <laughs> oh gosh. Daily salvage income was 2.6 million, which means we had 2.1 in profit. Decreasing that uh, just massive debt by a tiny fraction. <laughs> so, good morning, shipbreaker. I'm trying to decide if I'm just going to do one shift at a time, keep it to 15 minute videos or two. Today I'm going to go two, so we're going to have a couple long ones here to start the series. Um, we're just now level four, which means we don't have any upgrades available yet to level five. So, But we're just going to go pick a new ship. So we're not going to continue this ship because I, don't, I didn't see anything left to continue with. So... We're going to find something else. We're going to be, again, checking our uh, rewards. The Filsinger 1 Mackerel Exolab is definitely worth more Lynx tokens. However, this light cargo does come with two repair kits. Oh. Hang on. The uh, Pacific Smith 1 comes with two repair kits. Lower links tokens, though. Less, so less experience. It's, uh, it's a lower hazard level, which is probably explaining that. We just did a station hopper. I think I'm going to go for a light cargo. We'll s Actually, the station hopper is worth 7.2. This Exolab, it is one repair kit, but it's worth eight and a half million. Hmm, it does have electrical, the Phil Singer. It's a tough decision. Uh, let's let's do a new ship. Let's do the the Exolab. talking about we don't do that welcome aboard don't listen to her i'm dee dee oh, hey uh i'm kai kai your mic's still messed up how about 
now. Better. Oh, hey, I'm Kaido. Kai. Mike's still busted, huh? Oh, yeah, still waiting on the wreck to get to. Uh, heaven forbid they give us functional gear. I'm sure they're working on it as fast as they can. Cutter, I added you to the sector comms channel. It can get lonely out here. Helps to check in with each other from time to time. All right, enough chin wagon. Let's get back to it. Weave her out. Goodbye. Bye. Later, Rook. So that's the crew. That's our friendly uh, group here in this sector, I guess, of the space out here doing doing this job. So they're all kind of peers in the occupation. We're stripping the outside of the ship here to get started. Salvage secured. Usually my deposited. favorite way to start most ships. Clean off the outside. Kind of scout it out. See what else is out there. We already pulled the antenna off the bottom. We have the back Salvage engines. Registered. No fuel issues. We've got a door here. Go ahead and pull the panels off of it. Salvage accepted. Credit supplied. So you can kind of use your hands when you go through with the, the bumpers on the console. Helps kind of secure your way as you go. Ooh, what's this? A bunny. Oh, we gotta grab the bunny. I'm trying to decide if I should cut the windows first, or let's start going with the floor like we did last time. I think the floor made it nice and easy to throw everything down in the barge. This one's gonna have a lot of computers, I got a feeling. So let's go ahead and push this floor piece out. Well, maybe. Does it not want to go? I thought it... Trying to be a little stubborn, but we got it. Valuable object process. Credits awarded. Go ahead and get the next area of floor. Kit. We're going to go ahead and collect all those we can. Got O2 and fuel. We can collect a poster. Let's go ahead and do that. It's blue light. Send it on down. Salvage deposited. Applying credit to account. Warning. Your oxygen reserves are dropping below statistically profitable levels. Go ahead and collect the box. Ooh, got some electrical lines here. Oh, 
power cell. Chip bags get away. Additional rewards assigned. What is this? We've got a power junction box, but there's still power getting to it, so we're not going to pull it just yet. Because I think that would fry everything. Computers we can pull off. Salvage secured. Applying credit. Air locks. Little lights. The uh, electricity frying them, but me uh, hucking them with a gravity blast into a pit seems to be uh, no issue. Makes sense. Makes sense. Desk is going to the furnace. Table. Thought it just evaporated. On this shift. Salvage accepted. Credit applied. Salvage secured. Account credit applied. This shit good. Weaver. Just got the last cut. Let's go ahead and get that.
Exciting there. <laughs> oh, a little too exciting. Alright. Let's start getting this thing pulled apart. those wires. Ooh, $4.4 million shift. We did not destroy anything. Man, gonna have to write this one down because that does not happen very often. But that's gonna do it here for episode two. I hope you all enjoyed it. Let me know what you think. Hit the likes, the subscribes, all that wonderful stuff. And uh, we shall see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Peace.